3 a.m. September 4th and feeding time every two hours. Oh, he's so tired and you have to wake him up just to get him some food. This is Infamil. Barely drink any. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm gonna try to pump and give him um, colostrum. It's very little. Very, very, very little. You don't want my cookies. Sleepy. No. Oh. Well, he wants to be sleepy now, but he was pretty like crazy in the womb. Awake and all. In the womb, he wakes up around 4.30. 9.45 a.m. and breakfast time. Got a ham and cheese omelet and um, bacon with blueberry. And some milk, organic milk. Baby has been spitting up like no other. He's been crying all morning. It's okay, only when he spits up though. So we have to figure out something for his uh, meals. He hasn't been eating. He has been eating my colostrum though, so that's good. But he's been spitting it out as well. Not good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Brian holds him like a fragile baby. I'm like, no, give him some strength. Got a lot of lesson to learn. 1 p.m. It's about his fifth feeding, I think. And I just finished pumping. Brian's going to feed him the cholesterol. Tired. You gotta, you gotta put it in his mouth first, and then. No, I put it on my out. finger, and then he sucks my finger. Okay. Eat up, boy. <laughs> did you wash your fingers? Yes, I did. Okay. When he sucks, it'll go down his stomach, yeah. Ooh. Is he biting? Big suction. You gotta put it in his cheek, too. The nurse said put it in his cheek. That's fine, as long as he's sucking. I want to go down his stomach. About 1.45 p.m. We've been just chilling here, recovering, sleeping in and out, and um, baby just finished eating formula. About five to seven millimeters. He skipped two meals so early. O'Brien gave him 15. That was a lot for his body. Um, but he's all settled in right now, and um, he's got a little friend. I brought a little friend for him that I bought for him a few days ago. It's a little pig. It's an angel pig. So, hopefully that will comfort him. Hopefully he won't spit up as much anymore. He's more elevated. Um, today, I've been just recovering from all the pain in my lower proximity area. My belly, I got a massage, massage, make sure there's no blood clots and then blood comes out, just flushing everything and now drinking water and ordering food so that I can eat more and um, produce milk because I have a bad habit of not eating a lot. So now that I have to produce milk, so I have to eat a little bit more just for a month, just for you, okay? I wasn't even going to breastfeed at all, but we got the colostrum in. I think it was the first three pumping session and then after that, it's going to be um, full on milk for about a month. And that should be good. <sighs> I contemplated on trying to um, maybe consider giving Brian a second child before because he was working so hard and he was just taking care of baby and just being super sweet. But during delivery, I was like, hell no. We'll see about that. I was like, this is documented again. I can't. 
I just can't. I was dying. Of course I just you can't. Keep thinking about that last, that last push, and I was like, no. <laughs> and I was like, I don't care. I already gave you one. Like I said, promise done. So let's get some food in for this one baby we're having, and hopefully, he gets enough sleep. He's gonna be sleeping all day. All he needs to eat, sleep, poop, three things. You're gonna be back here next year, visit your sibling. No. It's lunchtime. I got myself a tuna sandwich right here. We're gonna share, me and Brian. Um, also, let's see what's in here. Ooh, this one's nice and hot. This is um, cream of mushroom soup. I love, love mushroom. And I think this one right here is um, steamed broccoli, so. I do have a third degree laceration down there, so I need to eat like soft stool food, you know, kind of type. So, yeah. Here's mashed potato and gravy it's right here. And low fat milk for the milk supply. Yeah, so there it is. And I got myself a chocolate chip cookie. Here, okay? Look at him. Knocked out like his son. I slept way less than Brian. Like, way less. I don't think I slept at all. Well, I slept like an hour um, yesterday before labor and then in and out of labor <laughs> in between contractions. So I was like, sleep. And then, okay, contraction, let's start pushing. And then, sleep. <laughs> He's got the hiccups. A squeak toy. Third meal of the day. I'm eating a lot. Brian ordered me chicken teriyaki, chicken noodle soup, um, broccoli for the soft stools, and this one as well, yams, and sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes and then um, chocolate ice cream and chocolate uh, milk. I don't know if I have cravings anymore though. Oh, and my chocolate cookies from earlier. But um, we're waiting for our baby to check if he has jaundice. It says that he might have it, so we might have to stay another night. It's okay, as long as he's healthy. Poor baby. <laughs> it's about 11.20 p.m. We decided to stay here because um, his jaundice test is not clear, so we have to stay one more night and make sure that he's, you know, good to go. Um, we're gonna flush his system out with milk throughout the night so that he can um, not have jaundice. They say the longer you stay and the older he is, and the more you flush his body, he won't have jaundice. So we'll do that tonight. Pump some more, and um, Brian's gonna do work because he's so behind. And um, I'm gonna eat. So I can pump. Okay, I'm not getting any milk. Like, I'm getting zero milk. So, I'm gonna do that throughout the night. And, um, yeah, one more day here, and we get to head home. Today, he's 24 hours old, and uh, four hours? About 27. Yeah. Yeah. So, welcome to the world again. Oh, look at him. Anyways, yeah, so. Oh, and food. We got sun chips in the cafeteria. We got, um, ooh, tuna salad sandwich. And we got milk because I need to 
get the milk going. And um, this is ham and Swiss croissant. And what else, what else did you get me? This is from their cafeteria. Um, cold pressed apple banana mango. This is a lot of, this is a green juice for you, right? For you. Is it okay? Oh, I'm not pregnant anymore. Just get liquid. <laughs> okay. You said get you very liquid. They didn't, other than soda, so I want to get you soda. Yeah, okay, thanks. All right, guys, I'm going to call it a night. Um, I didn't really sleep last night, but I'm going to try to do it today and catch up. So, see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Toodles.